Sharks are not just cool fish or something interesting to see on TV. They are literally the apex predators that keep our oceans in balance. But when you mess with that equilibrium, it has far-reaching consequences. What happens in the ocean impacts your daily life in dozens of ways that you probably never knew about, well, until now. This season on the all-new Shark Week, the podcast, we ask tough questions and demand answers. We're going to dive deep into the most fascinating topics happening to sharks and our oceans right now. We'll talk to experts from all walks of life, from fishermen to world-renowned scientists, from songwriters to shark encounter survivors. And I'm not going to shy away from controversial topics like, is it okay to kill sharks in the name of science? Or is there shark meat in your food and you didn't even know it? We're going to challenge policymakers and politicians to rethink the way we manage our oceans and we'll uncover the secrets of everyone's favorite formidable predator, the shark. You know, the conversations we have are important and sometimes uncomfortable, but they must be had. So there's certainly a link between sea slavery and shark finning. How many of these folks are going after sharks specifically? They're shark finning quite aggressively. Shark fins are used as a way to subsidize slave wages. The fins are collectivized between the crew. They put them in a bag, dry them out. And then when they get to shore, those guys, those crew are allowed to sell them to supplement their wages. And the captain, the officers allow that. I'm Luke Tipple. Join me on my mission to give sharks a voice. Listen to Shark Week, the podcast on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you get your podcasts. You're listening to the Shark Week podcast.